Case number 170-57081, people of the state of Michigan versus Valerie Margaret Matthews. Ma'am, you are charged with count one, police officer fleeing third degree under the vehicle code. This is a felony with a maximum penalty of five years and or $1,000. There's also a habitual offender, second offense notice because of a prior conviction. The maximum penalty could be increased by one and one half times. Did you hear the charge against you and the penalty that you could receive? Yes. So the court's going to enter a not guilty plea on your behalf. You come back to court for a probable cause conference April 13. Preliminary examination, April 19. Both hearings are at 8.30 in the morning at 3rd Circuit Court. Frank Murphy Hall of Justice, do you understand? Yes. Okay, as with any criminal matter, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say orally or in writing can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney to have one present during questioning and at all future proceedings. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided to you at public expense. Do you understand your rights? Yes. Okay, do we have any holds, DDC? Yes, Your Honor, she got a hold on the 43rd, no bond not listed, 40th, no bond not listed, 37th, 39th, 40th. She's also got a hold on Sandusky, no bond not listed. Okay, thank you. So, ma'am, the purpose of bond is to ensure your return to court and protect the public. Due to the nature of the charges, facts presented to this court, as well as the facts provided by the officer, that you have multiple holds out of multiple jurisdictions, which shows you do not always come to court when you're supposed to. Your bond's going to be set at $50,000, 10%. And ma'am, if you are able to post bond before you're released at your own expense, you are to be placed on a GPS tether. That concludes your arraignment. You can step away from the camera.